so we're learning about ultrasound equipment and um, how we can incorporate that in our classrooms. Oh, ultrasound would be great in the classroom. Um, first of all, it gives hands-on experience. It brings the topics or the content I'm trying to teach to life, and it might excite them to even start a healthcare career. What it does is it gives teachers new ways of approaching things uh, so that it becomes more exciting for the kids. So many things are taught in a textbook, 2D drawings, and even when you pull videos up online, there are a lot of diagrams and computer-generated images, but when students can actually put an ultrasound probe, say, to a knee or to their neck and look at their own bodies, it just makes it real for them. It just, it brings that reality to them and it's gonna plug them into their content that much more. And so that gives students a visual as opposed to a plastic model on the table. They can see it in a living organism. They can see how the blood travels using Doppler. So I think it's a great um, application for the classroom. Um, I know I teach the cardiac cycle, so how the heart beats, and so the students have a really hard time learning about the valves and the heart sounds, so being able to see the valves moving and then to hear the heart sounds makes a huge difference. Um, aorta and ventricle is what's called your mitral valve. To your right, it's called your tricuspid valve. So that's just the valve that's just keeping the flow. Since they're more informed, they could make more uh, informed decisions on how to take care of their bodies. And, and they could utilize this information to improve their quality of life. Actually is, this is a big 10 and that's because there's a lot of stress on your knees. Today we're teaching our other cohort of teachers various ultrasound techniques so that we can take this back to our classrooms and use it during case studies and hands-on collaboration with our other teachers at our schools. Based on my observations today, it seems as though my whole cohort has, has learned a lot about ultrasound. After we got through some technical things about uh, frequencies and understanding what was really going on, it was incredibly easy. It's something that you could learn in a very short period of time. It's a little hard to practice and do it on your own, but if you get somebody to walk through it with you a couple times, it's not hard at all. Ultrasound um, is very effective in the healthcare world, and what I'm hoping is that that can transfer into the classroom where um, our students can actually see how this, this technology impacts our life for the better. I just, I'm, I'm very grateful for this opportunity, and I just hope that I can bring this back to my school and that there will be more opportunities like this, more funding, for this because this is really where education needs to go. It needs to be a community driven effort because this, is, this has been wonderful. It's just been a great experience. I've learned a lot, met a lot of great people, and I would encourage anyone who has the opportunity to participate in this type of grant to do so.